Hey everybody, James Rule XRP here. This is video number 20. And I want to thank all of you for subscribing and liking the videos on my channel. It is really exciting to get the news with XRP and digital assets and all that information out to the public. So we can give everybody an understanding of what's going on. Today I want to cover the coal company or coal.com which was created by Stefan Thomas but before I do that I'm going to show you what I saw today I actually attended a webinar with the US Faster Payments Council in Glenbrook and today they covered faster payments and consumer bill pay and the presentation Glenbrook We'll present preliminary analysis from interviews that covered a variety of topics including bill pay trends, barriers to adoption, and how various industry participants are responding to the faster payment bill pay use case. Attendees will have the opportunity to ask questions about the results of the study and have first access to the research. So what they covered today was the way people in the United States pay bills and they're looking at for for faster ways to pay these bills. They had a survey which asked, do you pay your bills directly through your bank with bill pay, e-payments, do you pay with check, or do you pay directly to the, the customer? So as this webinar was taking place, mainly talking about banking and bill pay, I went in and I asked the, a question and they actually answered this question for me the lady was not too excited about answering it because, uh, but let me show you what I asked and what her reply was. Um, great question. Um, there was a question here on blockchain, so I'm going to read it. Uh, thank you, James Rule, for providing it. Uh, can blockchain and distributed ledger technology speed up the process if adopted? I understand that regulations are required in the United States to use these technologies, example, Ripple, on-demand liquidity for cross-border. So I'm not, we certainly didn't get at blockchain or distributed ledger in our interviews, uh, and I'm not quite sure um, I've been involved in a discussion on it, but curious if any of my Glenbrook colleagues have. Well, I, Beth, I could certainly comment on it from a, a practical perspective that in a domestic bill pay environment, um, I'm not a, you know, aware that blockchain would do anything to make this um, bill pay any faster, smarter, better than the faster payment model that's moving into the market. On a cross-border basis where we have multiple currencies, then, uh, you know, I think there are opportunities that could be examined here, certainly with foreign exchange uh, that needs to be looked at or some sort of guarantee of what the payment amount will be and that, in fact, uh, you know, the, the settlement will be made. Of course, uh, that's an exciting but very much an edge case in bill payment. Okay, so like Kevin Cage replied, the lady didn't sound really excited about this, but however, she did know that Ripple is using XRP for cross-border payments and exchanging fiat, so I did kind of get the bug out there, and I thought it was kind of exciting that they did answer this question for me. Okay, let's get to Coil. Coil.com. Coil was created by Stefan Thomas, who is the previous CTO with Ripple, and he is a co-creator of ILP, or the Interledger. Now, he founded, and he is the CEO at Coal. And I will go over what Coal is here in a second. I wanted to show you a Reddit article that I'm going to read it word for word. Uh, I'm Stefan Thomas, and I introduced millions of people to Bitcoin, was in the charge of the technology for the third largest cryptocurrency, which is XRP, and hate blockchain. Hello, my name is Stefan Thomas. I started programming when I was four years old and have been addicted to it ever since. Starting in 2010, I got involved with Bitcoin, 
produced the What is Bitcoin video that introduced millions of people to Bitcoin and created Bitcoin JS, the first implementation of Bitcoin cryptography in the browser. My dream was to make cryptocurrency mainstream, so in 2012 I joined a startup called Ripple. I told them that I wanted to be a coder only and not a manager. Eight months later, they made me CTO. While I was there, we built a blockchain that is 200 times faster, 1,000 times cheaper, and vastly more energy efficient than Bitcoin. The underlying cryptocurrency, XRP, is now the third largest in the world. I think cryptocurrency is a powerful idea politically and economically. But managing a blockchain system at scale sucks. A shared ledger, by definition, is a tightly coupled system, something we engineers spend much of our time trying to avoid with good reason. So what comes after blockchain? Interledger is a non-blockchain payment protocol I have created or helped create in 2015. Interledger is able to process transactions faster and at a much larger scale than blockchain systems. It's closer to something like TCP IP. It has no global state and passes around little packets of money similar to how IP passes around packets of data. So the Internet of Value is what XRP is. Last year, I founded a company called Coil. We're using Interledger to create a better business model for creators on the web. Instead of putting a company in the middle like Spotify or Netflix, we're putting an open standard in the middle and companies like ours compete to provide access. Some members of our community created a subreddit at r forward slash coil community. Okay, so he created coil, and this is coil. If you own XRP or are part of the XRP community, coil is tied in with the Interledger protocol, and they monetize web pages, whether it be YouTube, your personal web page and there's a piece of code you can put on your page and you'll get monetization payments every time it is viewed which are very tiny increments of XRP now these XRP monetization payments are tied in with uphold as you know if you have the XRP tip bot you have to have an uphold account so your XRP address or XRP account will be tied to uphold where you can transact back and forth with uh, not only the XRP tip bot but also Coil's web monetized content. Every day I'll get a text or notification saying that uh, web monetized content was sent to me .001 XRP or .005 XRP but it is coming to me daily as people view my content. Okay, Coil.com, a new way to enjoy content. Experience web monetize, monetized content in your browser while supporting sites you love in real time. Now, the membership is $5 a month. And with the membership, you, you can create a, a blog. You can go in and there is cinnamon video, which I'll show you in a minute, which is similar to YouTube, but it is monetized. You can set it up for monetization, so every time somebody views your uh, cinnamon video, you will get paid a small amount of that. Uh, $5 per month will get you access to all web monetized content everywhere on the internet with strong privacy protection. Your membership ships with Imgur Emerald, access to the entire video library at Cinnamon, support Twitch streams while you watch their streams, no tracking, your privacy is our top priority, support creators that have web monetized enabled content, access all exclusive content on Coil Blogs. Now, there's a ton of stuff in here. Uh, like I said, uh, there's a Coil Browser extension, which attaches the Coil Puma Browser, which is uh, tied in with Coil. So, it's a really neat. I'm going to go to my settings here and kind of show you. Uh, this is my actually blog, my blog account. And I have posted several blogs on here. And every time somebody visits it, I'll get web monetization. Let me go back. Okay, it has uh, the memberships, five monetized content. If you click here, see my YouTube channel, James Roll XRP is attached. That's the only account. I don't have my personal web page hooked up to it yet, but all you have to do is put this code in uh, on your web page and you will start getting monetized. See how it's, it connects to an uphold account. So we're going to go back. This is my cinnamon 
uh, video page and I've only uploaded two videos but like I said it's similar to YouTube but this is you get monetized every time somebody watches your video on cinnamon and to me I could upload videos a lot faster to cinnamon than YouTube uh, so it's a really good uh, page and like I said it's backed by the ILP Energy Ledger Protocol XRP Coil Ripple, everything is tied into coil. So I was just going to cover this information with you and let you know what's going on. I appreciate you guys subscribing to my channel, checking out my videos. Uh, I will continue to research Ripple and XRP daily. And if you get a chance, hit that subscribe button, hit like, and I will see you on the flip side. Y'all have a great evening, great morning, wherever you're at, and we will talk to you soon.